Hey Equestrian Gamers, Cooley here and welcome back to another video. We are finally, finally continuing on with the series that I started last year. Um, so we are continuing on with the Breeding Every Coat onto Frisians series. Now I only did, I only got three episodes in for that um, series. I did have to actually locate the horses <laughs> again because a couple of them I moved on to an alt account. So I've been running around trying to get organized. Um, I rewatched all the three episodes just so I know where I'm up to. And thankfully I do still have all the horses that I was successful at breeding. So before we get into the breeding, we have started this series off with the Appaloosa. So we're trying to get all the Appaloosa coats onto the Frisian models. So far they are gorgeous. I've been loving it. Now I have decided for this series um, that I'm going to... I'm not sure if I'm actually going to put this video out before the... Um, before my other oh wait is this going to come out first or after that one <gasps> probably after so if you watch my previous video that should be out by the time this one comes up um i did mention that i'm going to be doing all of this again and also that i'm going to only breed the coat colors that you can get in game at the moment so originally i was going to do the version one coat colors as well but i thought about it for a bit I'm like you know what I don't think that'll be fair on everyone because a lot of people um, may not have the version one coat variations so um, of like you know the quarter horses and the Clydesdales and the Appaloos like all of them so I'm like I'm gonna keep it to what is currently in game so then if you guys do see oh tokens sorry I got distracted if you guys um, do see a horse that I breed and you're like, wow, I really love that on a Frisian. I'd really, really like to have one. It'll be a lot easier because you can obtain it instead of having to try and trade um, for that coat color. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to be keeping with um, all the coat colors that are currently in game. Okay, so let's rewind a bit because it has been like nearly a year since I've done this series. So we're going to do a little bit of um, a catch up. So for the first episode, I did get one successful horse. So in episode one, I did manage to get the buckskin snow cap. Let's see, where are you? This one I couldn't find. It was really hard to find this one. So this was from um, episode one, the buckskin snow cap. Appaloosa coat onto the Frisian. This is the cranky girl. Oh, isn't it beautiful? Look at that. Very, very, very cute. And then for the second episode, so that was the only successful in episode one. And then for episode two, I only had one successful foal again, which was the Red Roan Blanket, this one here. Which I absolutely love. Like, look. She's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. My goodness. Oh, I really do love the Frisians. So that was the success, um, successful foal for episode two. Now, episode three, oh my goodness, that was the most successful one breeding video yet. So in that one, we actually got, hang on, we got three, three successful foals. Unfortunately, I just put music over that video. Um, I wasn't speaking, which is a pity because it was a really, really successful video. Um, I did play it on a public server as well. So there was a lot of people running around, a lot happening. I can't remember why I didn't do a voiceover, whether um, I was unwell or if the um, voiceover, something went wrong with it. I, I honestly can't remember. It was too long ago. That was in April. But for episode 
three, we did get the Bay Blanket, which is this one here. Really, really like this one as well. So the Bay Blanket, and then we also got, wait, am I missing a horse? I'm looking at, sorry guys, I'm looking at my little book. Did I find the chestnut blanket? Oh, wait. Oh no, where is that horse? Oh, I missed one. I thought I got them all. Oh, I'm going to have to locate the chestnut blanket. I have it somewhere. I have it somewhere. So the bay blanket and the peacock, which is this one. This was um, another successful one. How beautiful is that? White mane and tail too. So that's the peacock. And we also got the black snowflake. Which is right here. Another beautiful horse. I love the hooves. Oh, I did get the chestnut blanket. I just don't think I... I must have missed looking for that one. Oh, no, I do have it. Wait, let's just see if it's in storage. Hopefully it's not on an alt count. All right, so if we look up, because I did name the horses after the colours. Oh, gosh. Um, let's go with breed. Do not look at the top. Okay, I see you, Ken. Um, oh, no. Oh no, it must be on an alt account. Oh, I was not as prepared as I thought I was. Oh dear. I need to find that horse. I need to find that horse. Oh goodness. Okay. Where could it be? It's probably on um it's probably on the same alt account that I found. The other one on. Oh, I'm disappointed in myself now. I was so excited because I thought I was organized, but no, of course not. <laughs> when am I ever properly organized, guys? Hardly ever. Okay, so I'm going to have to... <sighs> hmm. Okay, you know what? No, we need to see all the horses. So I'm going to pause this recording. Um, I'm going to go scramble around and see if I can find that chestnut blanket Frisian. Okay, I found her, I found her. Thankfully it was nice and quick and easy. She was on the same alt account that the other horse was on. So this one is the final successful um, horse that we got. So this is the chestnut blanket onto Frisian. Really, really like this coat as well. Looks really nice on the Frisian. So those are all of the successful foals. Well, they're now horses um, so far. So out of all of the coat colors, so let's go to quest capture log. So we're going to go through the list. Oh, it's going to take a while, guys. So out of this whole list, the only ones we are missing is the gray blanket and the black leopard now thankfully i do have a couple of the black leopards from either purchasing from players or trading or purchasing from the stores so i do have some of them i just haven't caught one in the wild yet so we will pick you up dylan i'm actually going to put these horses um in the yard at my island i've cleared the yard out so yeah i think they'll be quite happy out there all right, so let's have a look. So I did grab all of the Appaloosas that I need. So I have a couple of the Black Leopards and a handful of the Grey Blankets. And then I made sure that I've got matching Frisian. So I have enough mares and enough stallions um, in the random Frisians to be able to breed as well. 
So any unsuccessful foals, I will be uh, selling them after I finish recording just to save on space. Though there may be a few that I'll keep on um, hand as breeding stock. But I think I've got a pretty good amount of breeding stock at the moment. Except for the black leopard. So if I do get a few more of um, these ones here. I think I will. If I'm not successful this time, I will hold on to them for breeding stock for the next episode. But hopefully. Fingers crossed, we get one of the grey blankets and one of the black leopards onto Frisians. So then we can actually move on to the next breed, which will be amazing. But I don't know how lucky we're going to be. All right, are we ready to get started? Yes, hello Francine, it has been a while. Okay, let's start with, oh, we're going to go with the greys. There should be the perfect amount, I made sure that all the Frisians um, had enough bonding as well. You need at least 25 bonding. So I just gave them a, um, a golden apple to make sure that they're all good to go. Okay, so depending on which horse you breed with, what coat color there is, you can get like a better, like a higher chance of getting the coat color you want, but I'm just gonna do it randomly. Just going to do it randomly. Alrighty, so what we want is this one here. So 7.56% chance is pretty typical for what I'm trying to do. And we want the grey blanket onto the Frisian. So whichever breed comes first um, in this section is the body type. So for an example, if it's Appaloosa Frisian, it'll look like an Appaloosa. Frisian Appaloosa, it'll look like a Frisian. Okay, so not too pricey. I deliberately made sure I didn't have any white Frisians to breed with because they get pricey. <laughs> All right. Oh my God. Okay. Let's see how we go. So we have a filly. Oh, it's a gray blanket apple loser, but that's good. I can use this one as breeding stock. Oh, I forgot that they don't pop up next to you anymore. They used to. But they don't anymore. Oh, so no success that time. So we shall keep on trying. That's why I've got multiple horses. Right. Yes, I do still have Squish. If you remember Squish the Frisian. Try this one. Okay, so I will be waiting on cooldown. So I've only got three of the following vouchers. So I don't want to um, use them. I'm more than happy to sit here for four minutes. I won't make you guys wait for four minutes. I will pause the video and start it up again once it's done. But yeah, so I'll wait this out. Um, and you guys will actually see me in like one second. Alrighty, cooldown is done. Let's see if we're lucky this time. Come on, I'd really like to get both of these horses. Oh, grey blanket Appaloosa. You're cute, but you're not what I'm after, darling. Oh no, okay. That's alright, we've, we've got more horses. <laughs> If I need more Frisians, I definitely have Frisians around as well. So we have one, two, three left of the greys. If I have to grow up foals, I'm going to do it. I really, really want to get these um, last horses done in this episode. So we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Okay, let's try with... Hmm, let's go with this one, which is the liver chestnut. So a little bit of a higher chance, so the 8.94% chance of getting the grey blanket on the Frisian with this one instead of, instead of like the 7 point, um, I can't remember what it was before. So hopefully, thank you paycheck, hopefully this will do the trick. A third attempt already, fingers crossed. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, another apple. Oh no, no, like you guys are so cute. You're, you're adorable, I promise. You're very, very adorable. Like look, very, very, very cute, but you're not what we need. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. How many more? I've got two, two, oh my gosh. 
Maybe I should switch. No, no, no. Let's finish these ones and then we'll go over to the other to the other one. Okay. Um. Oh, which one? Which one? Which one? Let's go with a grey Frisian. I'm kind of curious. Okay, wait. Seven. So seven, seven, nine for the grey. Seven oh one for the liver chestnut. That's interesting. I thought it was higher on the other li liver. Was it a different? Oh, someone's making a lot of noises out there. Seven. Se okay, let's just stick with the grey. Oh my gosh. And hopefully, hopefully we have a win with this one. All right. Yes, I'll be saying all right quite a lot. <laughs> I do that a lot. I'm sorry. Okay, all right, let's see how this goes. I just said it again. Terrible. So we have a cold. Oh, it's a grey Appaloosa. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, my goodness. All right. So this is the last um, grey Appaloosa that I have have as an adult at the moment <sighs> I wonder what happened if we go with you know what let's use the bay blanket why not oh the chance is lower ah oh, let's do it anyway <laughs> oh my goodness okay oh it's okay we'll figure it out we'll figure it out one of the things, because um, I did say it from the first episode, is because I'm like, oh, should I show how much, like, how many fails there are in the video, or should I just show the successful ones? And I'm like, no, we have to show all of it just to show that it's not as easy as you think it'll be. Um, there are some videos that make it look very, very, very simple, very, very quick and easy, and um, stuff like that. And I'm just like, no, I want to show the realistic. I'm not very lucky. Some people are extremely lucky when it comes to breeding horses. I'm just not one of those people. <laughs> As you can see, it takes me a while to be able to obtain um, the specific horse that I want in breeding. So I thought, nope, let's show from start to beginning. We'll see just how long it actually takes me to be able to get these horses. So hopefully... We're a little bit luckier with this one, but I don't know, guys. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Oh, I, I just got a paycheck before I unpause the video. Hopefully I've been unpausing it correctly. I think we're good. I think we're okay. All right. Oh, this one's a lot cheaper, actually. Okay. All right. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's a... Colts? It's another Appaloosa. Oh my gosh. Okay. Hmm. So we didn't have any success with the grey blanket so far. So far. Don't think I want to give up yet. Okay. What I think we're going to do is we're going to actually go with these guys. So the black leopard. So I do have three of those um, that, oh, thank you, that we can breed with. Oh, wait, 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 Did I get all the stallions? Oh, I did. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I get excited. I'm like, wait, there could be more. There's not more. Okay. <laughs> all right. So let's try and go with the black leopard. Black leopard? Yes, the Black Leopard. Okay, Squish, come on, Squish. Squish is an old-time favourite. So hopefully, hopefully with Squish, we get a little bit of luck. Here we go. All right. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We have a filly. Oh, my God. Why no Frisians? Like, no Frisians. Like, not even standard Frisians. Oh my gosh. Okay. It's all right. It's all right. We've got this. We've got this. Okay. Come on, Clover. Clover, come on for the win. Okay. Let's go with. 
go with the peacock, actually. Because there's half chance. It's 50-50 whether it's going to be... Um, is that a thoroughbred? Wait. Oh. I did not realise. You're not an Appaloosa. You're a thoroughbred. <laughs> but you've got the Appaloosa coat. Hmm. Still counts. Still counts. It's definitely the right coat colour. I just didn't realise it was a thoroughbred. I have a problem with um, distinguishing thoroughbreds in this game, apparently. If you watched the previous video, you, you know for sure. <laughs> okay, well, it still counts. It's still the Black Leopard coat, so oh, let's go with it. Let's go with it. Why not? But it is a 50-50 chance whether it's going to be one breed or the other. And I haven't even got a single Frisian. They've all been Appaloosa. So maybe, maybe Clover being a thoroughbred will change that. There is actually a much higher chance as well. Ooh, okay. Okay, let's wait this three minutes out. Oh, well, I will. You guys will wait like one second and hopefully this will turn the tide. Here we are. All right. Oh, come on, Clover. Come on, Clover. We believe in you. Be a good horsey. Give us a Frisian. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, a tiny little thoroughbred. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Oh no. <sighs> All right. Oh, hang on. I think the last adult is a stallion. Yeah, legacy. Okay. You're not a legacy. No, no, no. That's just a snake. Okay, okay, okay. All right. So let's pop you with oh, horse. Which horse? Okay, which is going to give us the biggest chance? So the grey is 709. Uh, 7 and 11 for the red roan. So 7, 11. Buckskin is less. Chestnut is less. Okay, let's go with the red roan Frisian just to try and give us better odds oh my gosh oh dear oh my gosh okay <laughs> all right let's see how this one goes here we go okay come on come on come on come on come on Oh, we already have the Red Roan Frisian, but we actually finally got a Frisian foal. Okay, so that's a little bit, a little bit better. But they were both Frisians, weren't they? Oh, no. <laughs> no, they weren't. No, they weren't. No, they weren't, because we're doing Appaloosas, aren't we? Okay. Um. Oh, what do I do, guys? Do I grow up some of these foals? So we have one, two, three... Four, five, five foals. Oh my gosh. Okay, you know what? We're going to do it. We are going to do it. Okay, so this might take, oh, should I, or should I, oh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm going to do this one, this one. And then I think I'm going to call it as a loss. Okay, what am I after? I'm after potions. I need a growth. Look, I've got one growth potion. Okay. Let's grow this horsey up. So because I used a growth potion, she already has 100 of your bond. Okay. Do I have a stallion? I do. All right, hang on. So the black stallion, 7.7. 7. 
and the liver chestnut is 684. Okay, so let's go with the black Friesian. Okay, I'm going to call this as the last breeding. So if this is not successful, then this round has just not been successful. <laughs> it's been a fail, essentially. Which is okay, because I do have foals um, that I can let grow up as well. So we're going to have more to breed with in the next episode. So hopefully, hopefully we can just get um, at least one foal this time. If not, well, it is what it is. And then hopefully the next episode will be luckier. It also gives me a little bit of time. So because it usually takes, oh, is it still three days on cooldown? Hang on, let me have a look. So where's Squish? Oh, Legacy. We've bred Legacy. Okay, so the cooldown is essentially two and a half days. So I'm going to um, round it up to three days. So I can't actually breed these adult horses I've already bred for another, like, three days. So, which is all good. So I can wait for the cooldown on them before I do the next episode because i will want to be breeding um with these frisians as well i have plenty of backup frisians i can use um but i thought i may as well keep them in my inventory so then i don't lose any of them they're all in one place so that'll make it a lot easier for me to be organized for next time but i do oh my goodness oh yeah, we're going to do one more and then we're going to call it. Because I think the video is probably nearly about 30 minutes at the moment. But what I'd like to actually do is we're going to go take the adult horses. Oh, should I do that now or should I do that after? No, 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 no. Let me breed this horse first. I'm getting ahead of myself. And then we're actually going to go put um, the successful horses into my paddock on my island. So let's just see, just in case we do get a successful foal for this last round, I'll just hold off for a moment. Which one was it? The, I think the black version was a bit more. Yes, it was. Okay. All right. So there's half a minute. Um, I will pause the video just so um, it just speeds the process along a little bit for you all. And yeah, we'll go from there. Okay, I didn't have to wait long at all. All right, final chance, final chance. Okay, so it's a Philly Appaloosa. Okay. <laughs> you know what? Francine was just like, nope, it has been way too long since your last breeding video. No luck for you today. <laughs> Thanks, Francine. I appreciate it okay let's head on to my island we're going to actually drop these horses into the paddock so i don't lose them again oh my gosh i definitely haven't been um grinding as much as i should be for the valentine event the previous video should unless something goes wrong should be just a cruisy video just a um going around grinding oh whoops wrong option private islands and we'll drop these horses off. Then I know where they are. I can keep an eye on them. I haven't actually done much with my island, guys. Not a whole lot of decorating. That's definitely something um, I need to do. There's a lot of things I need to do. So I'll put that on the list as well. And yes, thank you to the person that pointed out that Isabella did not have her aura. I don't know what happened to the aura. I honestly have no idea whether I accidentally put it on an alt account. I couldn't find it. So I actually had to take the aura off Isabella version 2 to put on Isabella version 1. So thank you for pointing that out. I must have taken it off um, for a screenshot and did not put it back on and then lost it. So <laughs> thank you for pointing that out. Okay, here we go. All right. So Bay Blanket. There it goes. So we have the bay blanket, we have the peacock. Do, 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 do. Red roan. Oh, 
Uh, which else? The buckskin snow cap. Very pretty. Black snowflake. I think that's it. Five out of the seven, I think it is. Let's have a look. We'll double check. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Yes. Oh no, chest oh, I forgot the chestnut blanket again. I am so sorry. This poor horse. There we go. Alright, so we have six out of eight. So we'll get there. We will get there. Hopefully next episode we get those last two. But these guys can stay in here. And hopefully, hopefully next episode we're a little bit luckier. Alright guys, I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you all next time.